simple wombo combo off j4 ulti rumble ulti oriana like there's a lot for gam to just flip the switch and take the fight struggle with that tin owns is going to struggle with that as well now at least you do have a good amount of counter engage like from tin owns yourself but hold on uh, level two does get hit the ignite goes down but I feel like Slater really wanted to fully commit to that. Now they can fully turn back on. Hello! Slater goes fully in, but I don't know if he's going to be able to get killed down. I think Root should be able to walk away. And that's going to walk any way forward. It's a two-level difference between Croc and the bot lane. Yeah, and, the, and Jarvan's already in the top side. He wants to look for a dive to see if he can counteract this play in the bot end. Yeah, they're going to try and see if they can go for a full dive here. It'll be difficult going up against Robo, but they're going to be able to get him fully taken in. Good flash there by Kiaya. And they get themselves out on bot side. So Gam. Gam are able to get away from that one in the bot end. We see them now going a bit aggressive on that top side. I see a bit of damage here, but uh, yeah, I was going to say, I don't think the Renekton really wants this one here. The flash oh. forward, he gets overheated, he has enough damage! And that top lane matchup is really going in favor of Gam now. Croc trying to equalize it out, he flashes forward just to confirm it, and will be able to trade it back two for two on the board. Tin owns now up here. Oh, LLL coming out on top. Yeah, just about. It is a little bit more cautious, because as that minion wave comes in, a lot of the damage is gone from the Q, so we'll have... Oh! Oh! <laughs> Flashing, get the W, and now we can see a bit of a move on the top side. The Equalizer not going to be utilized just yet. Kiaya knows he's dead. And that's just Katsi not really in position to help because Levi was on the Dragon, or sorry, on the Rift Herald. Now the Pop Blossom come out. They're going to get a flash out from the Oriana, and everyone's a little bit isolated. Do they get the Rift Herald? That is the question. Levi's going to have to flash away. He'll get the kill onto the there. Tries to interrupt the back, and Sales immediately flashing in. He knows the flash was already burnt in that Rift Herald fight. And Caddy gets caught out for it. Yeah, that was... You like that they just kind of backed off there? Kind of bitten. Oh, he's committing, though, because he's got the Q, the oh, isolation! Oh, oh, oh. And he gets himself the four procs on the... Three, nerdy, th or two and a half, three kills. Um, it's insane. Yeah, it is. An immediate flash has to do by Kiaya, but he gets caught out anyway, and they go straight in with the assassination. Kiaya trying to save the tower if he can, but not really a lot else going for them. And uh, he still lost something. Look. The only place that saves for Gam is their own base, and uh, Robo's just ignoring them. They use the TP on the tower that's going down! Why are you doing this, Gam? You can't fight that! And they lose the Nautilus as well, Palace. Because this is the part of the game that Loud are better at. The post 20 minute mark yeah. is when they come alive, yeah. and Caddy is feeling it! Caddy is feeling it, he's feeling the pressure as well. Double knock up comes in on top of it, they get the tangled barbs down. Levi forced to flash away. That's a TP coming in from the Rumble just to run away because he realizes he has no business being here. You have no reason to ever take these fights, and Loud are looking to put a serious marker down. They are coming for PSG. Yeah, damn, Gam, you do not want to be in these scenarios. Because it's Kiaya going to be able to walk away from that one, but he said it. Baron spawns. Leo is saying, hey, that looks nice and pretty, but well, let's go and take it. What if we took all the buffs? What, what if, if we get the earliest soul we could possibly think of and then take a Baron off, basically off spawn? Yeah, at base, not going to happen. And now they're getting turned on because they realize they've overstepped. Robbo's on a flank and they can start to pinch in. The Equalizer comes down to try and stop anyone from moving in, but Robbo just gets himself into the stopwatch. The Pop Blossom of Tinos signs the deck warrant here with the ultimate loud get everything getting good the reds feel a lot better as they are going to go under here he's going to go in but they've actually been able to catch out croc and he's not gone down just yet now he has robo does have a ga but he wouldn't like to use it just yet it's mong gets used and there's going to be an equalizer to try and stop them all they get the knock up here double down the feathers come in and root picks up a kill hulk comes out root shoots himself right into the backside triple go for the kaiser looking for a little bit more as well not quite able to get the last few uh, auto attacks there onto the zaya but will turn and burn no for the way. quadra kill and they have On to die one? they have day to die David, give him the penta. You have to go for it right now. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to get it on day one. He's got a couple more seconds. They're looking for it. They got the inhibitors down. They got the Nexus turrets as well. Finally, here they go. There's Slater with the stopwatch. Finally, they go in under the turret. It's going to be 